today uh, we're gonna make him uh, bread on auto bakery uh, oven kind of this one uh, uh, regal yeah regal so and this is the, the name of the, the thing the model number is um, so that's the model number k6726 came in China so it's first time we're gonna be trying this one and we'll see how it'll make uh, so when you turn on, that's what it says, th uh, three hours here was inside, basically. That's just a very normal, uh, any kind of auto bakery ovens. So this, as you can, we put the, everything here and we'll, we'll see how it'll work and how it's gonna be finished the bread. So it's pretty simple, this uh, cover, it can be removed by just uh, Yeah, so just like that. Nice removable cover. This also comes out so easy. You can clean this what's inside. That's the heat core, and that's pretty much it. Also, this piece you can remove and clean. We made some bread, so I didn't clean it yet. But uh, here's in the back. And the great thing about it, because it's all metal, so which is great, it has to be metal because there's a lot of heat and plastic simply will melt. So, um, here, so to turn this thing on, and as you see, uh, so basically three hours that's what's to start to finish. Uh, basic French, quick wheat, uh, dove ba baked, and uh, as soon as you put everything here, like all the milk, uh, all the water, floor, and everything else cover back and everything and once you as everything is ready I'll just put the cover back so once yeah and then you can press uh, start and it'll start spinning and everything you, you will see basically we're gonna do um, the entire video start to finish and until it's cooked and see how uh, processing and everything and uh, here it's delay time if you wanna like you know increase uh, hours and stuff or decrease and uh, by the way it's very recommended to leave the uh, the floor after when it's uh, being uh, dove and everything leave it for like at least maybe an hour hour and a half that way it will rise up and you will have nice fresh cooked uh, bread and uh, here are the menu selection basic uh, rabbit you change the French or quick and so on until if you have the dove already made and everything you just wanted to cook it choose number seven so number seven and then start basically will this will start the heat only so if you choose from one then this will all process until you reach seven and three hours time so it's pretty simple here are the uh, if you want to choose uh, the color you press here dark medium p medium uh, h dark uh, l light it's pretty simple and uh, I, th I think it's dark is the best or oh, that way you can have nice cooked bread and uh, that was it pretty much so um we'll uh, have everything set up and everything ready and stay tuned watch the entire video please and uh, please don't forget to support our channel subscribe like and share we have a uh, uploading we've been uploading videos uh um, pretty much every day new video and uh, the services are entertainments so we need your support so we can continue thank you and stay tuned so here what we need is they, they uh, this is a uh, yeast kind of bread yeast you know here and a cup for measurements um, magic bacon borders honey salt olive oil oil um, milk truth two and one percent two percent three percent doesn't matter and I'm using what you like about the bread if it's a uh, white or brown I use brown this is white a brown uh, flour, flour so bread for bread best for bread 
So let's start uh, putting the, we'll put, uh, let's say, we'll put like first, we'll put the milk first. So I don't, uh, you can use water, but yeah, this is so this is milk. Uh, it's very cold. We will warm up about, uh, we'll put it in the microwave for about uh, 30, like 30 seconds or so because we need the warm uh, to speed up the, the yeast. So 30 seconds. Let's get the milk. Uh, like here, add uh, maybe this one, maybe another one and that's it. So two, let's try two and see how uh, so two of those for now and uh, we'll stop for now and yeast we will use about uh, like a f tablespoon so it's about this much should be good that should be good um, I'll use a little bit of this it's optional you can you can use it or not but I like to use it uh, it, you know, it's about, it makes the kind of puffy for the braid. So this one is good. And a little bit of salt. So about, should be good. And of course, I'll use the olive oil and I'll use about maybe half a cup. Maybe it's half a cup of olive oil, and uh, so now uh, the for the warm milk we'll use uh, one cup first. So one cup. So here, uh, pretty much. Oh, we need honey. So we've had to put some honey actually, and we need about like not much, just about one uh, full tablespoon or something. You know, not much. I'll just use straight add in here. And that should be good. Okay, so uh, so here you can see there's have basic, and you can do like some different setting. You press menu selecting, you know, for different type. So when you press this uh, selecting menu, you can choose anyone from one to seven. And uh, basically, I'll, I'll choose the basic. So I'll put one. Okay, that's one. Press start. Here, here we go. So you can see now it's a uh, kind of mixing together. If we need more, uh, like fl floor, I'll, I'll just add a little bit more here. But we'll see how we have to watch to see the how they're gonna be like. Uh, if it's need more, a uh, little bit more, add water or a little bit more floor. So we'll, we'll wait and see. Uh, kind of mixing, but uh, you soon we'll see this one will spin fast for uh, better mixing everything together. So it's been about maybe three minutes, four minutes, still mixing. Ten minutes has gone by. Now it's time for yeast process. It's now time for yeast process. Now we shall close the lid. So it's been about uh, thirty minutes so far, and now uh, you can see it start mixing again. So after thirty minutes, it was kind of setting down. Now it's mixing again, and. Uh, because it's the first time I'm using this uh, uh, auto bakery braid, so I'm not sure how it's gonna work, but uh, we'll find out soon in this video, and uh, we'll see the result after when it's done. Actually, so stay tuned, watch the entire video, so you know uh, basically the process of this uh, auto bakery braid. There's kind of different models. Actually, they have a light here shows where to uh, 
uh, which process time and where is the processing stuff like that here it doesn't but uh, this one seems like so far it's doing fine so just wait and we'll see so it's mixing right now it's a little bit uh, kind of bit, a little bit bigger the Two pieces, I don't know why it's here, but let's uh, uh, get just a little bit bigger actually and we start uh, mixing it again. Mixing started about two minutes, it's been about two minutes so far after 30 minutes. Uh, so it's the first 10 minutes mixing, then stop. For 20 minutes uh, resting, then uh, starting uh, mixing again after 30 minutes in processing time. We'll pause the video and we'll see how it goes. So stay tuned, watch the video. Please don't forget to subscribe, like, and share this video. Check out other videos in our multi channel too. You may like one and consider subscribe. We need your support so we can continue mixing about um, like maybe good. Eight minutes or so, Eight, ten minutes, and uh, still mixing. So now we stopped again after uh, mixing second mix, which is about took uh, last for fifteen minutes. And so remember when we start, it was three hours. Now it's two hours and twelve minutes. So uh, still uh, here are the and still getting a little bit big, but not much. I probably didn't uh, mix enough uh, <coughs> for the braid, just a little bit. But uh, it's just to try first time and also to show you guys about this uh, bakery uh, oven. It does not, it's, oh, here it says automatic. So, yeah, automatic braid maker. So, it should be automatic then. then it's been uh, about 15 minutes gone. Stop it and switch it manually to 7 for start bakery. But first, we need to leave the the, <coughs> the dough, dough to be uh, processed for, uh, for the yeast processing and stuff. So, and we'll continue. Uh, videoing until we finish completely and see the result of this uh, uh, regal or regal or something like that so yeah automatic braid bakery or baker uh, gone so far and uh, two uh, left uh, time left two ten two hours ten minutes now start getting heat so I feel a little bit heat inside here a little bit heat not much just tiny little bit not much so we'll leave it and we'll see for how it'll be the process okay thanks for watching stay tuned and and see the entire video please so now i i basically i fixed the first uh, five minutes it's, uh, it looks like it's starting at uh, uh just one hour and it's been now the heat started i can feel the heat here and uh, pretty much uh, see if you'll be able to see you see, um, I think I put a lot of uh, olive oil, um, but for next time, um, pretty much I'll do the uh, exact uh, measurements and everything. So j just for a quick uh, and review testing about this uh, Regal Automatic uh, Braid Maker. So, you know, just to check and uh, to see if it's working fine and stuff like that. I hope this video will be a helpful for you guys and uh, if so, please don't forget to subscribe, like, and share. Uh, check out other videos in our multi channel. We upload videos regularly every day, surfaces, and entertainments. So uh, stay tuned until we uh, finish this. We'll pause the video until this 53 minutes passed, and we'll see how the braid is cooked and everything. Uh, I First, I put it on medium. Uh, I was choosing dark, but decided to put it on medium. And uh, so we'll see how it's going to work. So basically, you see, there's pretty much a lot of oil there because I put a lot of oil but well, anyway it's a uh, olive oil so it's not really bad for uh, health also and we'll see if uh, after when it's done so so far it's only left uh, 33 uh, minutes so 32 minutes left and here you can see the, the start cooking heat I can feel the heat pretty much all over here here this side is very hot this side also and so far looks really good and um, we'll wait uh, until it's done and we'll check it out as soon as it's finished so another 32 minutes to go until it's done stay tuned and 
see how uh, it's cooked after it's done. So far, since we started, it was about set for three hours, right there, six minutes left. And uh, you can see the bread, it's taking shape. And so I put it on medium. Uh, I'll see if uh, after one's done, after six minutes, uh, we'll see if it uh, needs more or so. I'll just set it up for, I put it back again, just select dark and maybe set it up for another five, 10 minutes. But we'll see if the bread is really well cooked, done and everything or not. And uh, so another five more minutes to go and we'll check it out uh, as soon as done. So it's all done so far and uh, it looks like it's so hot so i'll leave it to cool off a little bit for about five ten minutes or so and we'll test uh, the braid if it's been cooked well or not so um stay tuned and we'll be continue shortly 10 minutes passed after when it's done and uh, now you see this uh, so I'll try to um, get a knife or something. I'll check it out and then we'll see how it looks like. So it's still super hot actually, very hot to touch after 10 minutes when it was done. But uh, uh, I just need to check it out and uh, so see. And it doesn't, it doesn't look like it was well cooked. So. I'll probably leave it another 10 minutes or so and well because uh, I'll set it up for medium now I'll put dark so to choose this menu uh, simply by pressing oh here uh, yeah so Seven, and then press start so basically that's uh, actually I'll do timing so yeah it's the minimum one hour but so when I press start it should uh, now it's manual and only the oven is on now if you press like start from the beginning basically we'll start over again and again you don't want to spin or anything choose number seven from the menu and uh, and then time it's set for one hour but I don't leave it one hour I'll just leave it for maybe 10 minutes 15 minutes I'll come back I'll check it if it's been uh, really cooked so so far it's been about uh, like almost 17 minutes I'll put it on manual on baked only and it seems like uh, maybe I didn't mix the braid right or something, but it's not. Uh, so I'll leave it another 10 minutes. But before uh, I'll flip it, try to flip it over. Maybe that will help uh, fast uh, for cooking. So I'll flip it over and we'll see how it goes. So this is the, the super hot. So I'm trying to that's the pan. See, oh, look at that. Looks pretty good from here. Inside is not done really well. So I'll put it back this way. I'll put it back in again. You can see now it's on. I'll leave it for maybe 10 minutes and I'll come back to check it out later.
uh, gloves, heat the gloves or something because it's very, very hot. So I'll just show you after when I kind of flip them, I, I cut the braid and I flip it. And this is what it looks like. The smell is fantastic actually, it's really good. It smells really good. And it looks pretty good. Okay, actually, basically you, what you need to do is choose all dark if you need the braid to be too cooked inside. Choose a dark edge, which is more timing also. Um, basically, the dough didn't have time to raise up. So uh, at least you needed to leave it, like choose the timing after when, uh, and uh, leave it for about like an, more than an hour or so. That way it will rise up more and the braid can cook nice and easy. Because it's my first time using this, so I have no uh, much experience about it, but I learned a lot of things today. I hope this video will be helpful to you guys. And please forgive me for my mistakes and, you know, things I did wrong and stuff like that. I probably mixed the, uh, I didn't have uh, right mixing for the, to make the braid. But next time I'll, uh, I'll choose the right mixing and everything. But it looks so good and it tastes really super good actually. Very nice. I like it. I really recommend this one. It's super good. And um, so I didn't, as I said, like I didn't read all the instruction, manual instruction and everything. But uh, it's all done, looks good. So please don't forget to subscribe, like and share this video. Uh, check out other videos in our multi-channel. You might like one, consider subscribe. We need your support so we can continue on and see you next video. Thank you so much for watching and best regards.